In the eerie forests of Alan Wake 2, Remedy Entertainment takes a daring plunge into the unconventional, crafting a meta-narrative that's as enthralling as it is bizarre. Straying from the norm, the game weaves a winkingly meta-journey through Remedy's own lore, at times feeling like a creative odyssey where the studio gets high on its own fumes. Picking up 13 years after the original game, Alan Wake to delves into the mysteries of the dark place, a dimension of psychological nightmares. The narrative unfolds through the eyes of two protagonists, Alan Wake and FBI agent Saga Anderson, whose tales parallel and entwine in a dance of psychological horror and ritual murders. The shift from the spooky to the truly terrifying adds a layer of survival horror, emphasizing resource management and strategic use of light against the formidable Taken. Unlike its predecessor, Alan Wake to opts for tension and release over a smooth flow, emphasizing a constant state of alertness. The game introduces wolves as formidable FOs, creating memorable cat and mouse encounters that contribute to the overall sense of dread. While combat mechanics remain impactful, encounters sometimes feel unceremoniously dropped, lacking the finesse seen in Remedy's combat-heavy titles like Control. Where Alan Wake to truly shines is in its storytelling. The game embraces an evil force that distorts reality through art and fiction, resulting in an absurdly meta-narrative that blurs the lines between game, fiction, and reality. Remedy's infectious enthusiasm keeps the narrative fun, punctuating big ideas with humor. The game manages to be frightening, atmospheric, and dramatic, all while being the funniest game of the year. Alan Wake to goes beyond traditional cutscenes, experimenting with live-action sequences, detective cork boards, radio excerpts, TV commercials, songs, and more. The game bombards players with a myriad of creative storytelling techniques, creating a rich tapestry of weirdness. The ability to switch between protagonists adds a unique layer to the storytelling, revealing fascinating connections and parallels. Presented with visual craft and flair, Alan Wake 2 is a technical powerhouse. While the use of light and shadow may not match the first game's impact, the detailed graphics and realistic character animations are impressive. The game's high system requirements may pose a challenge for some players but the visual spectacle is undeniably breathtaking. In embracing a shared Remedy universe, Alan Wake to adds depth to its mythology. The incorporation of the Federal Bureau of Control and unapologetically Nordic elements showcases Remedy's unique perspective. Set in Washington but infused with Finnish culture and Norse mythology, the game feels like a celebration of Remedy's independence and confidence. Alan Wake 2 is a glorious sprawl of surreal horror that stands as a testament to Remedy's creativity and uniqueness. Unrestrained and completely itself, the game offers an experience that lingers, leaving players haunted by its terrifying encounters, quirky narratives, and memorable TV commercials. In a gaming landscape often defined by formulaic approaches, Alan Wake 2 is a breath of fresh, albeit chilling, Air and must play for those seeking a truly unique horror experience. are turning into monsters.
The cult is leaving supplies around for themselves. Wonder what's inside. I should take a look around for a way to open this thing. <laughs>